these Larson spices almost look blue, uh, which is what I would expect to see in China, but we're not in China. Hi, and welcome to another daily challenge video. Yes, I had a near perfect score in India, few very good rounds in Bangladesh and uh, Luxembourg, even though I was in Belgium in the uh, Luxembourg round. And then two rounds where I was quite far away in France and Brazil. Uh, but still good enough to get a silver score of 18,500 points. So that's the first silver score in a while. Uh, I am playing with the no move pattern soon. Uh, let's see if we can do as well today. And I'm just going to jump in. Okay, uh, looking at the landscape, uh, I'm thinking somewhere in Africa. So landscape and buildings, uh, I think it's definitely somewhere in Africa. Um, let's see. Um, it looks like the sun could be to the north, but it's quite difficult to tell. Uh, there are no shadows, but uh, it looks light uh, uh, in the sky uh, towards the north. Two places I think this could be. Uh, Either, um, uh, either Lesotho or Rwanda. I think I'm going to go Rwanda. But I'm not entirely sure, to be honest. So I'll go somewhere like here. It was Espertini, so uh, I was in Africa, but not uh, in the right country. Uh, okay, uh, this one looks like Kyrgyzstan, especially with, with the um, uh, with the red tag on the license plate, and you can see the uh, roof rack uh, in the shadow here. That's the roof rack of the uh, Kyrgyz uh, uh, Google car. Now we're looking towards the north. Uh, we are on something that looks like a main road. I think we could be in Bishkek uh, on one of these main roads. Like uh, we had a round in this one, not on that road not long ago. Maybe we are on this one uh, because we. The road goes slightly to the northwest. And this road is more northeast. Could be on this road as well. It's another fairly straight road. But I, I'm going to go uh, for this main road here. Uh, you can see there are. Uh, there's still a lot of small houses uh, along it, uh, just like we, we can see here. I'm just wondering if I can see any houses that fit the direction of uh, the houses we see here. Uh, so we can see one. Uh, runs along the road. Uh, all the other ones are perpendicular to the road. Can't really see that. I'm just going to have a look uh, along uh, along any of the other roads or the, the other roads as well. No, so there, there are no houses at all running al or, uh, along this road. This one doesn't fit out. I I'm going to leave my marker there. I could be way off anyway. Uh, yes, I was. Um, uh, this was south of Bishkek. I mean, we did see some hills in the distance, uh, which were uh, with uh, these hills here. Um, good to know uh, for another round. Um, I didn't realize there were some hills 
uh, between uh, between Bishkek and uh, the mountains you usually see to the south. Uh, anyway, uh, a tough one. Um, not a lot to go on. Based on this uh, mile marker here, I think that's a mile marker. I think we might be in Asia. I don't think we are in South America. I think it looks similar to what do you see in Cambodia and maybe uh, maybe Thailand. Uh, I don't know which uh, country this is. I'm going to go Thailand. Uh, but I'll go down here, close to Cambodia. Ah, it was Sri Lanka, okay. Uh, see what we have here. Okay, so we can see a bit of the Google car. These license plates almost look blue. Uh, which is what I would expect to see in China, but we're not in China. It's a roundabout in the distance. Uh, see some palm trees. Can't remember seeing this Google car at all. Sun appears to be to the north. So this is a Google car I haven't seen before. Uh, I don't think I'll uh, be able to get the uh, get this at all. But I mean, if I get a continent right, I'm, I should be happy. Um, so I think we are in the southern hemisphere. This roundabout sign it looks a bit European. So I think that looks similar to uh, to the French roundabout signs, uh, which could mean that we are somewhere like uh, somewhere like here in um, uh, that's Reunion. Uh, not sure about Mauritius. But it looks a bit too flat to be Reunion. Also, I'm not sure about the blue or dark number plates there. Uh, I'm going to go Reunion. I'm, I'm probably way off. Uh, yes, I was. <laughs> I was Senegal. Okay, I've not seen a car in Senegal before. Um, and also, I didn't realize I had the uh, blue number plate. It looked like a blue number plate. Uh, anyway, uh, Let's see what we get in the last round. Uh, this has not been a great daily challenge for me at all. Yeah, okay, so we're driving on the right. We can see the uh, bottom, or we can see the back of the uh, Google car here. Yellow number plate. In the southern hemisphere, as far as I can tell. We have a lot of mountains to the northeast. Um, I think 
possibly South America. I'm going to go Ecuador, but I, to be honest, I have no clue where this is. Okay, that was Chile. I didn't go Chile because of the yellow uh, line in the middle. Uh, I mean, I'm obviously wrong, but uh, I always associated the yellow lines in the middle of roads in the uh, in uh, Chile to be much further south. Uh, so I think this must be the worst uh, daily challenge I've done in a very long time. Only saved by the Kyrgyzstan round. All the other ones were way, way uh, off. Uh, right, anyway, as always, if you like these videos and would like to see some more, Please consider subscribing to the channel, also hitting the like button and leaving a comment. And I shall see you again tomorrow for another daily challenge. Bye for now.